Cause I'm over 45 Cause I'm over 45 So <laughs> sorry I've offended you Hey, we are Story Phantom and we are here today with more Randy Rainbow. This time, we won't vote Trump. Yeah, we never did. Mm -mm. Well, he didn't vote at all. Yeah, I read you out. I meant to, but I was busy. Besides, you know. I like how he said this time we won't vote for Trump. I know, that's why I was <laughs> like, we didn't vote for Trump. I voted for Hillary. I hated her personally, but but I will never ever ever be stupid enough to vote Trump. I mean, we were taking turns because the previous election I voted for Obama and you didn't vote, so you know. That's because I never voted, really. I'll be honest, I was not a big fan of like voting because honestly, Number one, I felt like I didn't know enough about the politics or what they stood for to really make an informed decision. But as soon as it became Trump versus Hillary, it was like, yeah, no, we ain't doing this shit. I will vote. <laughs> so, so, yeah. yeah. We are uh, watching the new Randy Rainbow. I mean, to be honest, our state is a blue state, so regardless, like, it's not like our vote actually matters, but... <laughs> I still do it. Now. <laughs> now. Now. You never know. Now. now. <laughs> you keep saying it like that now. 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 Now, before we get to the song, though, you really failed. quick. You already missed one of them. I know. We have something we have to talk about, and that would be... Subscribe or drive. Subscribe or drive. Subscribe or drive. Yep. Subscribe or drive. We're trying to get more subscribers. Subscribe, subscribe or drive. So in order to get more subscribers, we are trying to offer a reward. A reward. Yep. Like if we get to more subscribers, we will reward you with a story of poop cookies. Ace Ops Fables by Brandy. Poop cookie. <laughs> it doesn't sound better. No. Julius. It's also dishonest. Yeah. See? Also dishonest. It's not. It teaches you something. That's literally what Aesop's fables did. And let's be honest, considering how messed up those fables were, mine would fit right in. None of those of our fables were about poop. So poop cookies. We will tell you all about <laughs> poop cookies. Aesop's fables by Bradley. But for a great two hundred subscribers. Plus, when we tell you the story of poop cookies, we will tell you the sequel. Free of charge. charge. Called <laughs> Poop Cookies 2. I like how he's Poop Cookies 2. Free of, Free of charge. charge. You already said that. I know, but we wanted to interrupt you and you didn't let us interrupt you <laughs> last time, so we had to do it now. Drop and Free charge. Of charge. <laughs> you I like it. how we had the same idea. You also miss her the now, by the way. Anyway. Look, let's be honest. I always forget anything that I say I'm going to say from now on. Because I can't remember anything that I have said previously to that that I would say from now on. Anyway. And some of them are really funny. I just can never remember. Yeah. Anyway. We're going to go ahead and watch. Ah, oh, medication. The heart of heartful bitch. The maj majesty of I won't vote Trump. I have no idea what song this is based off of. This time, apparently. I, I have a guess, but... It's probably wrong. Yeah. Well, what song? And now I can't remember what it was. I remember thinking to myself, I bet it's this song. And I started humming it in my head, and then I forgot. And here we are. You can't remember? No. Okay. Damn you, medicine. Let's just go. Just to be clear, we are taping this. We are back, <laughs> Mr. President. How are you? I'm the football guy. 
Oh, good. Sir, the election <laughs> is around the corner, and it seems your campaign strategy has been to ramp up your divisiveness and bigotry, uh, spread misinformation, even disparage the military. The news is so fake. Listen, I get it. I was once an aspiring comedian just like you. I posted <laughs> offensive things for shock value. It was a disaster. Calm down. The difference was I was doing it satirically, you know, using irony and exaggeration to point out absurdity, saying and doing things through a persona that I wasn't actually saying and doing. You know, kind of like how I'm not really at the White House with you right now, see? It's just a green screen. But I changed my act when I realized there were actually awful things actually being said and done by actually awful people, just like you. Look, and once I had an actual platform, I vowed I would try my best to use it only for good. Aren't I great? You know, I'm not sure. And with November so close, <laughs> there is one more vow I've taken. Would you like to hear it? I don't have time. Raise your tiny hand and repeat after me. I. I. I won't vote Trump. I won't vote Trump. No, there's not a chance in hell. No, there's not a chance in hell. I will try to make a difference. I will try to make a difference. Cause this isn't going well. Cause this isn't going well. So don't waste your bad breath on me. I'd sooner cast my vote for Cardi B. I'll never vote Trump. Trump, never vote Trump, never vote Trump. Not me. Come on, sing. I won't vote Trump. I won't vote Trump. I will jump through any hoop. I will jump through any hoop. And if someone tries to make me, and if someone tries to make me, I will throw a can of soup. I will throw a can of soup. <laughs> if there's a chance that I could get this bloated Cheeto off my TV set, I'll never vote Trump. Never vote Trump. Never vote Trump. Not me. No, that's a very common Not thing. Not I. Girl, please. But it'll make the country great. Uh-huh. Pencil take <laughs> you on a date. <gasps> no, thank you. What if they manipulate and make you not feel so inclined? I've made up my mind. I won't vote Trump. I won't vote Trump. To the polls is where I'll drive. To the polls is where I'll drive. If I'm 18 years or over. If I'm 18 years or over. Cause I'm over 45. Cause I'm over 45. So <laughs> sorry I've offended you. But when it comes to voting, I work blue. I'll never vote Trump, never vote Trump, never vote Trump. Not me. Not me. Everybody. Not me. I won't vote Trump. I won't vote Trump. I don't want another four. I don't want another four. And if someone steals my mailbox, and if someone steals my mailbox, I will build a hundred more. I will build a hundred more. I won't vote Trump. I won't vote Trump. I will vote without delay. I will vote without delay. I will do what's necessary. I will do what's necessary. Just to make you go away. And though I've made some past mistakes, there's one I won't no matter what it takes. The best is yet to come. I'll never vote Trump, never vote Trump, never vote Trump. <laughs> not me, not me, not me, not me, no girl. So fake. Girl, tell me about it. <laughs> so was it the right song? I have no idea. I can't remember what it was. You still don't know the song? I thought maybe listening to this song reminds you of that song. No, but I'm assuming it wasn't because I also didn't recognize the song, so there you go. I mean, I'd, from the cadence, I think it's a show tune, but that's about it. All I could tell, but um, yeah, I'm not voting Trump. Mm -mm. He's not old enough, <laughs> but he wouldn't. I'm not. Oh, we saw, I, I was pointing at Julius. I thought you pointed at me. I'm like, what do you mean I'm not old enough? Oh, trust me, you look older than me. <laughs> no one will believe that lie. <laughs> <laughs> Cut off your pretty red hair. <laughs> Don't you remember? Oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> you jerks. I'm not You're a jerk. You're a jerk. You're both Your jerks. Your daughter did that to you. Not me. No, you did that. No, right? he did that to me. That's why okay. he's a jerk. Well, either way, I didn't do that to you originally. No, but you're the one bringing it up, so you're a jerk. <laughs> you're a jerk. Basically. On a serious well, note, though. Mm. 
Damn. <laughs> On a serious note, okay. If you are gonna vote by mail in ballot, mail it in by like the middle of October. October thirteenth is when everyone is saying. Honestly, I agree. But if you can look up where you can drop it off, and you can also choose to drop it off, to drop off two other people's ballots. So they have to agree to it. They have to, like, put you down as a person to drop it off for them. I'm pretty sure they can do that online. And you can do that for them if they can't leave the house, like I'm doing for my mom and my grandfather. Seriously. Don't vote Trump. And And if you you don't trust the post office like I don't anymore, just fucking go drop that shit off. And if you really, like, you can't go drop it off for whatever reason... Look up the demographics of where you're voting. And if there's a very conservative, full of white old people neighborhood nearby you, or go drop it off there. Yeah. Because they're both going to make it. Promise you. Mr. I'm going to run a post office like a business. Yeah. Which, by the way, if he's running the post office like a business, he's running it like they'd run Blockbuster. Into the fucking ground. I miss Blockbuster. That was my takeaway. <laughs> Basically, I believe this guy who run the post office is friend with Trump because he apparently is exactly the same kind of businessman. I mean, who loses money in casinos? Wait, what did you just say? Whoever Trump appointed to take over the post office is running to the ground. I believe 100% he's friends with Trump. Like, they are. No, like, I wouldn't have any doubt because just like Trump, the post How- office took it and he's driving but, it to the ground like Trump in his casino. I know, I know. You don't have to I, actually say that because it is a fact. I know it's a fact. Knows but it. if I didn't know it was a fact, but if I didn't know it was a fact, and you told me they were, I would 100% believe you without having to go on my phone and do any research independently, which always research things independently. Because I'd look at what he did at the post office and say, yeah, no. You spit on me during your whole rant, which you didn't even have to do. Because Emma knows. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have to answer. He didn't have to spit. Bull. <laughs> okay. Well. No one needs you, Rona. <laughs> I'll give you Rona. Mask up. <laughs> We're gonna do that just because he farted. It didn't even end up smelling. Not for you out there. <laughs> I liked it. But seriously. Wait. To vote. To Not for Randy Trump. Rainbow or the fart? Randy Rainbow. Okay. I want to make sure. Don't vote Trump. Vote on time. And, then, and if you're one of those people out there like, but Biden's so terrible. He sucks. He's there not is Trump. nobody worse than Trump. There is literally. I mean, I'll be honest with you. I'm not excited about Biden. But I'll do it to save the world. But I'm not excited about Biden. That's what me and my friends were talking about today. Like, we are not excited I about saw Biden. A like, demographic at all. I right get now. it. But we hate Trump. And if we continue four more years this way, I promise you, it is not going to end well. And the world is going to end. Well, I saw, I don't remember where I saw, well, I remember where I saw, I don't know who posted it on Twitter. It was a demographic comparing Trump to Adolf Hitler. And basically. Oh, yeah. People are for, for sure making that comparison. Well, basically, they're about the same position. They've claimed all the same things. You know, the news Especially are lying. Especially considering his whole MAGA group is saying that if he doesn't get elected, that they're going to start a civil war. Yeah. There's all this That's stuff going on. Basically, we've hit every milestone, and we're about I'm gonna be six. Honest, we are never leaving Chicago again. That whole visit to Michigan was the last time we're leaving Chicago until all this shit is like over, because that was terrifying. <sighs> Basically, we're just about six years <laughs> from oh, shit. Trump's the like, first oh, shit. death camp. We're in the wrong place. Because he's David, already doing you're eugenics. You're going and buying groceries. You white enough. The rest of us will die. <laughs> this literally, is all a true story. Literally what we did. Yeah. He's apparently already doing eugenics. There have been, you know, 
mass hysterectomies and ice facilities oh, and that. all that kind of stuff. He's basically hitting every ticker. We're about six years out from just straight up rounding up death camps in Nazi Germany. I need y'all, like, Trump supporters to, to come at me with the pro-life after the whole forced hysterectomy thing. I need someone to, because I want to get that I out just, so bad. I just like the whole thing. I want to get that out The so people bad. who are like this. After his what, you said? They're doing forced mass hysterectomies in some of the ICE detention camps. Mm. Like, if you even say you have, like, a serious cramp, they're like, oh, I'm going to take your uterus. And it's like... And then one girl, like, she had, like, a cancer cyst on her left ovary, and the dude, like, took out the right one. Wow. And they're only using, in that particular case, they're only using this one doctor who is, like, yeah, it's not good. I'm just saying. Um, I was reading that, but it's bad. No. I agree. And I was going to say, but I've now lost it. Someone to come at me so bad. <laughs> I do. Like I don't go out there like starting stuff on the internet, but if you come at me, like I'm there for it. Well. Oh yeah. We think we've digressed enough. What do you think? Oh yeah. Probably. Bye. So. I liked it. Yes, me too. Yep. I still don't know what song this is. I bet it says in the description. I miss having an actual mouse. I don't know why whenever I shrink this down, it always pops down here. I feel like I shouldn't have done this. Hmm. Yep. Like I just shouldn't like be bouncing on your shirt. Like it's a trampoline. It does not say. Hmm. What does it say in the comments? Alright, y'all. You know what it's a parody of. Drop it in the comments. That's all I gotta say. Okay. We'll see you guys next time. So if you like our comment, like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Get your poop cookies. And for real, find out. don't vote Trump. Yes. We have a Twitter. We have a Facebook. We don't have a Discord. Sorry. We will see you guys next time. What the hell was that? Don't ask me. <laughs>